I'm Al Campbell, leader of the analyst team in PMC that aims to produce timely and up-to-the-minute information for the Prime Minister on COVID-19. I'm really excited for the launch of the data profession in the APS, as it will ensure we use data to help drive better decisions and better outcomes for the government and for the Australian people. In 2030, just 10 years away, I want to see our data professionals become the preeminent problem solvers of the public service. We can do this by bringing together the roles of data scientists and data engineers to also fulfil the role of translators. People who define and prioritise problems to be solved, people who identify data needed to execute the outcome, as well as communicate those data insights and recommendations to ministers and to the government to drive and inform better decisions. We must nurture and we must reward our technical talent to allow career opportunities for analysts to move to data leadership roles. Having analysts in the room for key decisions with decision makers, giving them a seat at the table is so very important. Also being fast as well as accurate in our analysis gives decision makers the right information when they need it. In government and in public policy, this is so important. We, and we have seen this through the pandemic, need to give our data professionals the authorising environment to be comfortable with providing decision makers with the best analysis possible given the turnaround times. Because the best analysis in the world is no use if it doesn't get to the minister before they make the decision. In the APS, timeliness is just as critical as accuracy. I'm really excited for what data in the APS can deliver. And I know that the data profession will help get us there.